was all just a horrible nightmare. I didn't kill anyone. Get ready and go to work. Oh, my head. It feels like somebody shoved a steel bar in my brain and then melted it. Gotta make it stop. That should help my migraine. Notice reads, don't take with alcohol. Wrists are still bloody. Gotta do something about that. The sheets are full of blood. I can't go back to bed. I'm not tired anyway. This is Lucas Kane. I'm not here right now, so please leave a message. Hello, Lucas. It's Marcus. I'm calling because tomorrow is the 10th anniversary of the accident, and I thought, well, maybe you might want to go together this time. Anyway, give me a call. Goodbye. Hello? Hello, Marcus. Lucas, it's good to hear from you. I thought I'd call to find out if maybe you wanted to go to Mom and Dad's tomb together. And, to be honest, I thought it might be a good excuse to get back in touch with you. I need to see you, Marcus. I'm in big trouble. What are you talking about, Lucas? What happened? I can't really talk about it on the telephone. It's serious, Marcus. I'll meet you in half an hour at the park. See you there. New York police, please open the door. These images in my head, I must be losing my mind. This will hide the blood, in case anyone comes in the room. I'll change the sheets later. New York police, please open the door. The police, they know, they've come to arrest me. Police, open up. Just a minute, I'm coming. I can't let them find any evidence linking me to last night. I've got a couple seconds to hide everything before I get the door. I'm sorry to make you wait like that. I was in the shower. Are you Lucas Kane? Yes. Mr. Kane, the neighbors heard yelling from your apartment. Is there a problem? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was me. I cut myself on some broken glass and I freaked out a little. Fortunately, it wasn't a really big deal. Would it be all right if I took a little look around your apartment? <sighs> Whatever. Go ahead. happened to your wrist, sir? I told you I had a stupid accident with some broken glass. Holy cow. 
When you cut yourself, you go all the way, don't you? Thank you for your cooperation. Uh, sorry to have bothered you, sir. You know how it is. With everything that's been going on, uh, we prefer to be careful. I understand. Long, Mr. Kane. <laughs>